Yes, there is Call of Duty in the background, but that does not mean for one second that my expertise of the pussy is limited or false, okay? I'm here to explain my philosophy of fingering females. When doing this, whether you have fingers that are fucking gigantic, tiny, round, cut up, smooth, soft, super long nails, white, brown, black, should probably cut your nails. But with these fingers that you have here on your hand, you can do magical fucking things, okay? There are three things you need to remember, three rules you need to follow, three things you need to know when fingering the sweet little vagina that you want to fall in love with, okay? Well, I don't know what your purpose is. But when I finger a girl, it's because I love the girl. It's because I value her, okay? You want to make her feel good. Now, the first thing, number one, is that this is a tool, okay? This is not sex. This is not uh, some fun activity. You got to view it as a tool. You got to have the right mindset that this is to make this girl curl up in a little ball of fucking pleasure and just fall the fuck in love with you because you know what the fuck you're doing, okay? This is a tool to get her to want your fucking cock, for her to want some more, for her to... Just be completely blown away by what the fuck you're doing to her. Because your fingers are good. But, this leads into my second, my second point. Your fingers are not your cock. Okay? You don't want to be fucking, you know, using it like your cock. This, this, the fingers are, um, maneuverable. Okay? Particularly at the joints. The, you know, you look at your finger right now. Fucking look at it! There's two lines, right? Look at your middle finger and your index finger, okay? These are your, uh, these are your friends. Or possibly later uh, advanced tactics, your ring finger and your middle finger. But there's two lines here. Those little things that bend, those, uh, you know, how, you, how, your, how your finger bends, okay? Those are your friends. Those will help you the fuck out. The reason I say don't use it like your cock is because... You know, I've talked to some dudes, and they say that they just jam this shit back and forth, hold their fingers stiff, and, like, that's it? No, that's not what you want to be doing. You want to be hitting this girl's G-spot, which is up there at the top. It's the roof. Now, that doesn't mean that fucking her with your fingers is bad. You know, a little bit of that can be good, but that's not, like, all you want to be doing. You want to be doing a come-here motion. Like, if your fingers are pointing, if you put your hand flat out, like you're asking for some money on the street... You take your fingers and you point them to your face. And then you want to get good at doing that kind of fast because you're going to be rubbing the top of the pussy just like that. That's going to fucking get them, okay? The third point I wanted to bring up, which is an important thing, is you want to take your time. Before you even think about touching this pussy, you want lots of foreplay, lots of mental, like, playing with her, you know? Use your words and a hangout session, you know? Get her warmed the fuck up. And then once you start in getting into making out, you want to take your fucking time. This drives girls crazy and fucking works out for you because you end up not having to do so much because she'll just be fucking going crazy wanting you and she will be the one wanting to go fast if fast is necessary. So take your time making out, touch those titties, you know, little, you know, sensual grabbing, slowly working your way the fuck down. Take your time, you know, spend like 20 15 minutes making out, you know, teasing her, playing around and shit, okay? And before you enter your fingers, you want to make sure this shit's wet. If it's not wet, don't just fucking back to square one, you know? You're going to dip your finger in there and make sure the honey's dripping, okay? And then at that point, that's when you can start making your move. That's the green light. That's when you reposition yourself so you can get a good angle down there at the puss. Once you're down there, you slowly insert the fingers, maybe like a quarter of it. And then you hit the roof. And then, you know, you just slowly, slowly start giving her more of your fingers. And then by the end of it, when you're fully in, you are just full on, fast paced, rubbing the top of that shit. And she's screaming. And you want to try to get an orgasm out of this before you just think about putting your dick in. So, yeah, slowly start this off. You want to tease it a little bit. Uh, start the pace off slow as far as, you know, the finger motion. And then just slowly work your way up. And you got yourself a really happy girl. It's important. Uh, I think I covered the basics. 
Hopefully you've gotten a boner by listening to this video because, you know, it's very graphic and lots of images in your head. I fucking know. I got one. Click the like button. Leave a comment down below suggesting what kind of video you want me to make next. I love you, kings and queens. Go finger yourself a vagina. And use your mouth. Goodbye!